Halo guys, welcome back with me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Our PEC Plus oil output cut ahead of winter fares inflation concerns. Singapore liters global oil supply in is set to tighten, intensifying concerns over soaring inflation after the Our PEC Plus group of nations announced it, its largest supply cut since 2020 ahead of European Union and Borges on Russian energy. The move has united of diplomatic rift between the Saudi black bloc and Western nation, which worry higher energy price will hurt the fragile global economy and hinder efforts to deprive Moscow of oil revenue following Russia's invasion of Ukraine. Global crude futures jumped this week, returning the two to three weeks high. After the organization of the petroleum exporting countries and their allies, including Russia, on Wednesday agreed to slice output by 2 million barrels per day just ahead of peak winter season. This is likely to drive spot prices higher, particularly for Middle East oil, which meets about two thirds of Asia's demand. Industry participants said, adding to inflation concerns as governments from Japan to India fight rising cost of living, while Europe is expected to burn more oil to replace Russian gas this winter. We are concerned about a resource gains in international oil prices which have shown some sign of calming down since the second quarter. A spokesperson at SK Energy South Korea largest revenue toll returns. Another South Korean revenue source say the supply cut could drive prices back to levels since since in the second quarter, South Korea, Asia for largest economy and a manufacturing powerhouse, has seen costs skyrocket due to the surging commodity prices. Rent hit 139.13 a barrel in March, the highest since 2008 after the Ukraine war sparked fears of Ukra Russian oil supply flows or O or R. Actual cuts. Saudi Energy Minister Abdul Aziz bin Salman said the real supply cut would be about 1 million to 1.1 million basis point a response to rising global interest rates and weakening world economy. That move triggered a sharp response from Washington, which criticized the OPEC Plus deal as short sight, short sighted. The White House said President Joe Biden will continue to assess whether to realize further strategic oil stocks to lower prices. Saudi, UAE, the United Arab Emirates and Kuwait are likely to take up most of the burden of cuts, said Tilak Doshi, Managing Director of Doshi Consulting, who was previously with Saudi Tadao Triple two. It is a slap on with an administration faced by OPC Plus, he said, adding that taste between Russia and Saudi seem increasingly tight. OPC Plus oil output cut ahead of winter fires inflation concerns. Singapore liters global oil supply in is set to tighten. Intensifying concerns over soaring inflation after the OPEC Plus group of nations announced it, its largest supply cut since 2020 ahead of European Union and Borges on Russian energy. The move has united of diplomatic rift between the Saudi black bloc and Western nation, which worry higher energy price will hurt the fragile global economy and hinder efforts to deprive Moscow of oil revenue following Russia's invasion of Ukraine. Global crude futures jumped this week, returning the two to three weeks high after the organization of the petroleum exporting countries and their allies, including Russia, on Wednesday agreed to slice output by 2 million barrels per day just ahead of peak winter season. 
This is likely to drive spot races higher, particularly for Middle East oil, which meets about two thirds of Asia's demand. I think that's all from me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe.